What is going on guys, it's your boy Death Gun with another Monster Hunter World video. Today we're going to be talking about this week's events and limited bounties, starting off with the limited bounties. First off we have Ecology Survey, Hunt Down 3 Toby Kadachi. After that we have Ecology Survey, Hunt Down 4 Anjanet. And after that we have another Ecology Survey, Slay 4 Balhasax. Overall they're pretty nice and once you've done all of these you will get your Gold Wyvarian Print and your Golden Egg. They go very well with this week's event, so I want to ask you guys, what do you think of overall the events we've gotten for this week, and what do you think of Arc Temper Valhasak? With that being said, let's check out the events. First off, we have Yaku with that, which is a really, really good quest to get tons of Zenny if you're an early on player. You can get about 50k per run, which usually takes 2 minutes. I have a video on it, so go ahead and check it out. Then we have Greetings from the Gluttonous. Overall, a pretty nice quest if you're looking for meal vouchers. Then we have Deep Green Blues, which is a very, very good quest to farm gold crowns. Now, a quick tip, you do not have to kill every monster and complete your mission. If you're just missing one crown, go in, find that monster, kill it, and then you can exit the quest. Now, the Deathly Quiet Curtain is the quest that's causing all the uproad. The Arc Temper Val is here, and he's an amazing monster. Not much has changed, but he does have some interesting mechanics. I have two videos that pretty much cover everything you need to know. One covers the armor set and his new moves and new pattern, and the other one shows me having an actual first encounter with him. Then we have Snow and Cherry Blossoms, which is a really good quest to get tons of Hunter rank. I highly advise you guys check it out. On top of that, the materials from these monsters sell for a ton of Zenny. And last but not least, we have a Nose for an Eye, which is a really good quest that also gives you tons of Hunter rank and gives you really good materials. On top of that, much like the other one, you can sell everything and get tons of Senny, so I highly advise you guys check it out. Now, with that being said, I pretty much covered everything there is to know. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Make sure to smash that like button and subscribe for more Monster Hunter World content. And if you guys want me to cover anything in particular, let me know. For now, your boy Death Gun, out. Alright, let's get him with one. I just gotta get him with one. Right here. Whoa! Fatality!